Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Metal Gear Solid 5 The Phantom Pain. We got quiet into a little bit of a scuffle at the end of the last episode, but that's fine. Everything's fine now. She's back on my chopper, Please not killing my men, which is fantastic. Um, we have one mission, and that is to abduct, abduct the exo of another group of child soldiers. Mission and there's only one way in. So let's go ahead and do that. Hopefully we can take care of this the same way we took care of the uh, of Eli. And just, you know, knock him out from really far away. You know, drag him back to the chopper and get the hell out without being seen. That would be nice. That would be very nice. And I remember when we took Eli that all the other kids kind of ran away. So let's see exactly what happens here. Your mission objectives are to extract the child soldier's commander. And their captive, the general's number two. Oh, there's two way out. Soldier take. platoon decided to break away from the Mbelli militants. They took the number two captive and have occupied an abandoned village. Start by checking that location on your map. So is the number two a kid? Our soldiers will treat you as an enemy, but they're just kids. See that they don't get hurt. Yeah, yeah. No killing children. I get it. That's a general good rule just for like you know everyday life. Reconnaissance is best conducted from high vantage points. I've marked a good spot on your map. Take a look at your iDroid. Oh, do they want me to go to a specific spot to scout from? Because this is the first time he's ever done that. Marker placed. So I'm guessing this is like story... story-driven scouting. Hey, in this cutscene, we have specific camera angles, so you need to go here. Okay? Okay. Oh, there's stuff. Maybe? Oh, there's nobody there. Hmm. I bet they're gonna kill the guy. Let's go really far away from the base so you can't save him. You have arrived at your destination. Or maybe not. That's the general's brother, his number two. Alright, it is a man, so I can... Out of their boss. I can balloon him if I have to. There he is, the commander. Extract him. Alright. Alright, cool. Any more kids that I have to mark? There doesn't seem to be that many. Hmm, maybe they're in that building. I have my sleepy sniper rifles. I can't really get... Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna start knocking them out and see what happens. I guess. Weird. That's weird. How many of these guys can we knock out? Like, right away. Like, can't just be this easy, right? Could be this easy, <laughs> and then Enemy something happens. Detected. The map has been oh, approaching threats. Yeah, there's more guys coming. That's what I kind of expected. What are they shooting at? There's a lot of guys. Security will be tighter now. Watch yourself. Of course. 
That's fine, though. I got this guy out. That's the target prisoner. He's injured. Looks oh, I, he's too. injured. There's no way he can stand the shock of a Fulton extraction. Get him out by chopper. Okay. Boss, another child soldier has entered the village. Must have been out on patrol. Yeah, I know. Looks like they had more than one patrol out. Okay. Security will be tighter now. Watch yourself. That's great. That's fine. Where can I get pickups? Please select a landing zone. Back there and up here. Hmm. Mm, let's mark. Let's see how close we can get to there. Without running into like a large group of guys. That'd probably be preferable. Because we can't really shoot them back. Quite can shoot them back. I can trank them. I'd rather just not encounter them at all. Let's see if we got any, uh. Oh, there's some. Oh, another prisoner. prisoner doesn't look like the target. That's weird. And that's the sleeping gas specialist. I gotta get him out of here, too. Thank those freaking jackals. Please. I appreciate your help, Quiet. Awesome. Alright. You and you can come with me. I'm carrying this guy. I'll save two people at once. There we go. I'll keep carrying the injured guy while I save you. Because I'm kind of badass like that. And let's just continue on and get you on a chopper so I can go back and kidnap their XO. So, because okay. I am Subject is kind of a badass. Man, there's a lot of donkeys here. <laughs> Most commonly uttered sentence. There's a lot of donkeys here. Alright. That's bad. We didn't even run into any kids on the way up here. In fact, we ran into a, a rogue hostage, because they're really bad at keeping prisoners, apparently. Oh, he's awake. I can't even see him from here, he's too far. Come on, Chopper. I think my... Did they notice my helicopter? Or they notice me. Prisoner's gone. Come on. Get in there. All that's left is to extract the commander. Alright. Time to run back. I wonder if Peacock will stay there or not. He'll probably up off if I tell him to. Now he's gone. Support helicopter has arrived. Extraction arrived at mother base. Nice work. Keep it up. Alright, let's see. We gotta drink all these kids. I wish I had my sleeping mines. Do I have my sleeping mines? I don't remember if I even... No. Never brought them with me. Sleeping mines are kind of cool. They're just landmines that put people to sleep. I do have sleeping gas uh, grenades, though. Which can be useful. But all these... They're all kind of spread out, which makes it easy. Oh, I thought that was a kid. We just gotta make sure not shooting exploding barrels, but anything. The map has been updated. Now they've all ganged up on their leader. There's gotta be some seams, though. Enemy We're not gonna be able to detected. take these containers the map has been updated. unless we get everybody asleep. You got a laser sight. You got two snipers aimed at you. You're lucky your child. Come on. That one kid's got a helmet, which is gonna be a problem. Let's 
shoot you in the leg. Oh, I missed you. Come on. Fire. Just trank him. Is this is the commander alone? No, he's not. He's definitely not alone. Fire. Enemy presence detected. The map has been updated. Excellent work, quiet. One kid's still in that building. That's okay, I don't think he matters at all. I just don't want to be spotted by anyone. Oh, there's another guy, huh? Or is that just a helmet on a table? No, that's a kid. Can't mark him, though, because F that. Why would I be able to, even though I can clearly see him? Alright. Coming up on the commander again. I think he'd be surrounded by men, but he's not. Enemy presence detected. The map is being updated. That looked like it might have hurt getting a dart to your face, but that's okay. And we'll just grab you and get out of here. What could go wrong? Caution. Rain approaching. Yeah, rain's fine. All right. Where's our heli? Enemy press. Please select a land. The map has been we'll just the road. helicopter Roger. requested. Well, that was pretty easy. Trank guns and trank sniper rifles and stuff really make the game a little trivial. I might stop using them, to be honest. Maybe not on the kid missions, because the kid missions you need them, like, really badly. But on uh, other missions, I don't know. It kind of makes everything a little easy. Just a little bit. That's ah, fine, though. I kind of do want to shake up the playstyle a little bit as I go through the game, just because I want to try new things, different things. And when you do beat the game, they actually don't even allow you to use that stuff. They, uh, they have subsistence missions where... All of your weapons are on-site procurement, much like Metal Gear Solid 1. Which seems like a cool thing. Yeah. Easy peasy. No problem. I didn't even think I was spotted. Top secret Black Ops. On-site procurement of... Hostages. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. Mother base. Child X1. Development project has been added. Mission complete and how? They're gonna tell stories about this one, boss. Nice. I mean, I did kind of defeat a man on fire. Are they gonna tell stories about that one? Probably not. Pretty heroic. About how we report this one to the client. I'll tell them we took heavy resistance from the renegade platoon and the hostage was killed in the firefight. Also, their leader wouldn't let himself be taken alive. I doubt the client will pay us for this one, but we got a big enough reward from the general's number two instead. Oh, really? And as for the number two, he's saying he wants to join Diamond Dogs. I guess he knows what that means for him. He said, if I'm working for you, I can be number two, or number 200 for all I care. I don't trust him. Ooh, Archangel. Cool. Quarantine platform has been constructed. Oh, I don't like where this is going. <laughs> We're going to have a zombie apocalypse on the freaking base, aren't we? Can't we just throw them in the ocean? Just freaking throw people in the ocean. Put a tape recorder next to them. <laughs> And, like, just, like, lower them down in a cage into the water and be like, Alright, tell us everything you know. You can, like, confess all your sins before you die. <laughs> but you're infected. So, uh, 
Get the fuck out. Boss, we have an emergency. Many of our staff are falling ill. At first it seemed like a common cold, but before we knew it, blisters started popping up on their chests and... Damn it. I'll fill you in at the ACC. Just get in the chopper. Get to the chopper. Got it. I want to know if my puppy's okay. And if Emmerich's okay. I'm oh, a medical team level down. Look closely. Those are the symptoms of the infection on Mother Base. The blisters on the body were full of tiny worms. Parasite larvae, most likely. Gross. But we couldn't find any adults. It doesn't seem to mature in the body, like a sparganum. We don't know the root of infection, or what causes symptoms to develop. Boss, do you remember seeing these symptoms before? The bodies floating around in the oil facility, the bedridden test subjects at the Devil's House. This epidemic looks just like what we've seen on our hunt for Cypher. So this is the weapon of mass destruction Cypher was working on in Africa. Boss, the situation is urgent. We need to quarantine the infected and contain the pathogen. Priority now is to prevent more casualties. But the problem is, how do we tell who's infected? During the incubation period, we have no way of knowing who's clean. You'll have to try and guess who's infected before they go symptomatic and quarantine them. That'd be easy if we just knew the route or vector of the infection. From now on, if you even suspect a staff member's infected, use your iDroid to order them into quarantine. Oh, great. Given the situation, I have, like... the men won't submit to quarantine just because I or the medical team tell them to. But they will listen to you. Of course, it's just a temporary measure until we find a permanent solution. We have but at least nearly a thousand men. I have to go through a thousand so men and each other check them. We get the mental care they need. If we do nothing, we'll only lose more people. God damn it! We have no choice. Boss, open your eye droid. Gross. I'll explain how to quarantine staff members suspected of infection. Go to the mother base menu and select staff management. I'm there. First, take a look at the quarantine facility we've set up. Okay. We'll isolate anyone who's already symptomatic at the quarantine facility. But we have to expect that there are multiple staff who are infected, but asymptomatic. So how do we identify them? At present, we have no way to tell them apart. But there has to be something for us to go on. If you notice anything, reassign staff you suspect are infected to the quarantine facility. We'll monitor them, and then contact you if there's a change in their condition. Correctly quarantining these asymptomatic infected will reduce the number of new infections. This seems really complicated. with your missions as usual. If Cypher is behind this, going after them should help us determine the root cause of this epidemic. Also, until we identify the pathogen, we can't fire or dispatch any staff. We cannot let this thing spread. Oh, now, man. Boss, get to the I have 994 people in, counting on you. in my ranks. I have to go through 990-some people. That's messed up, man. But anyway, <laughs> thank you everyone for watching. We will deal with this next time. Later.